a dessert with another man. Oh my oh, God! Yeah. Imagine the nightmare if somebody thought <laughs> you were gay. What about sharing a dessert and maybe your knees touched? Oh right? my uh, God! We're gonna share this dessert, but we're yeah. not homosexual. I, I heard something. Uh, Morgan, you went to a Korean barbecue place and you didn't like it? No, Whoa. I loved it. No. Okay. Loved oh, because somebody told me that you didn't like it because it took too long. Oh. No, no, we agree. So Morgan yeah. and I were talking about, we agree. It's I was going to say, Korean barbecue usually, rules way too long. Right. The only reason I wouldn't like it, and I go on Saturdays <laughs> usually, is because you got to wait like an hour to even sit down. Um, yeah. It's so packed. However, the so last not, time I went, there was no wait. But the process yeah. itself, you don't. You don't like it, you don't like the it takes forever like cooking your own stuff. Well, I like it because I go with friends who cook for me. So uh, no, I don't like cooking it. But thankfully, yeah. I'm with people that like yeah. to do the cooking. For folks who've never been, can you describe the setup, Menas? Well, first you wait an hour, which Greg would love. <laughs> yeah. You get a seat roll, because yeah. every Korean barbecue spot is always packed, packed. no yes. matter what because it's good. Yeah, and it's like groups of like 15 people too. Yeah, and then uh, you sit down at the table, and there's like a little grill and they'll bring you while you order your your plates of meat which different pieces of meat that you want and then they'll bring it by and then you cook yourself on the grill yeah and so yeah. you get a little teeny tiny piece of meat yeah. after waiting an hour <laughs> you grill it yourself which takes a while then you eat it then you have to wait another 15 20 minutes before they bring by another plate and yeah. then you cook your little teeny tiny piece of <laughs> yeah. meat if they're not again. bringing you one little piece of meat they they bring I know, out but a if you're a group of 15 people like yeah. you're getting like a, a slice of meat every 20 minutes quick. yeah, yeah. It takes to it's great. I would I never go it. there with a giant group of people. I would go yeah. there with like maybe one or two. Yeah, four, like, four yeah. max. Yeah, four, four max. Yeah, yeah. see, max. I go, I go in a group of four, and it's perfect. However, yeah. it's so busy that Menace is right. It takes the server forever to come back and bring you your next thing of brisket yeah. or whatever you know. So I love the Korean barbecue. The other thing that I don't think Menace would have the patience for sea bass. Certainly, my wife and I love going to the melting pot. <laughs> which is that place where it's the fondue place. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, your yeah. favorite. Love that place. You know why? Because it is a nice, slow, relaxing. Exactly. Like we actually have time to sit and talk because, you know, uh, during the week or, you know, our regular dinners together, like it's in between kids' activities and I'm trying to get work done. She's got this other stuff going on. So like we're scarfing food, trying to get the kids at the table at the same time. Like, can we just sit and have, like, one meal together? Mm -hmm. Someone's finishing homework, and the other person's maybe off at their activity still. So we just like that nice chill. And you're cooking that. Slow roll of the melting. And and you're cooking that one bite at a time. (laughs) Yeah, please explain to me more. Because we actually, we've gone to the melting pot together. But But for dessert. Only dessert. Yeah. Now, melting pot That that was easy because you could dip stuff in chocolate. (laughs) Melting pot's faster, though, because you could put four, five, six skewers into the bowl of broth. True. Or like oil. you're stuffed after the melting pot. But if you go to Korean barbecue and it's just one other person, that's plenty you're fine. Stuffed. I mean, yeah, you yeah. you yeah. can do multiple things at the same multiple time. Multiple meats. It, they yeah. do take a while to bring out the meats, though, even when you have a smaller right crowd. But I mean, it is all you can eat. Most places, right? The place <laughs> yeah, I go, is I would all imagine. You can eat. Yeah. 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 I just, yeah. I'm, I'm still picturing Menace and Woody sitting together. At the melting, the melting pot. Oh yeah, guys. we, we cr- cross forks or whatever. You know, as we were, <laughs> we were out of town for some business thing, and, like, and no, we, we were walking by, we're like, "Ooh, melting pot!" Ooh. And we went in there, and we went in there to dip stuff in yeah. chocolate. Yeah. As a man, oh. I cannot see going into a melting pot with another man. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, that's gay, right, Greg? Oh because yeah, it's yeah. Gay. How dare You're you? Just too manly to do that. Yeah. Like you said, it's designed for romance. What kind of Neanderthal? Right. Is, it's designed for a, romance. I thought you were a man oh. of the modern times. You go yeah. to a bar, bro. Mm. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah. Bro. we broke out shot and then we went to the melting pot. Which, by the way, we did sit at the bar. Oh, yeah. oh, there's that. Yeah. Okay. The other businessman. Awesome. Imagine As the you nightmare. Did your, your strawberries. <laughs> we, oh, we even and <laughs> brownies yeah. and, and rice krispie yeah. treats yeah. and pound cake. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, oh, we we didn't share that we we crossed spoons uh, just recently. We, we did share that dessert together. <laughs> we what did. Was that what was it was like a I peanut don't butter pie thing? I don't remember. I don't think I've ever been at a meal. We're with at another... that Italian spot. We crossed spoons. Like I've never had. Oh. I've never ordered dessert with another man. Oh my oh, God! Man. Imagine the nightmare if somebody thought you were gay, dude. Well, wow. oh my God. Yeah. What about sharing a dessert and maybe your knees touch? Right? Oh my God! Yeah, there's nothing more so homosexual. The, but you know, you'd probably be in the clear, Seabass, if like before the dessert got there, you very clearly stood up on the chair and declared no homo. Yeah. <laughs> Look, I mean, that's, a that's start. what you got to do. Look, we're gonna share this dessert, but we're yeah. not homosexuals. <laughs> <laughs>
I, uh, I'd just like to let everybody know. Uh, <laughs> I can't have any stranger. I was uh, slamming last night with two chicks. Yeah. <laughs> I have know. sex with women. I'll go as far as to say ordering dessert as a man is almost gay. What? Ordering yeah. dessert? Uh, that, so that's how hetero I am. Now you've gone way too far. Wow. What? You, you would never order a lava cake. That's how hetero he is. Ooh, it just, lava it cake. Seems a bit, like dessert seems like, like Greg, like a cats or girls, right? Yeah, cats or girls. I like think dessert cats. is for girls. I mean, like... <laughs> A cat what? is a pet for a girl. Since that's for when? Sure. You eat so much cake, sea bass, yeah. when it comes in here on cake birthdays. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah, so you basically yeah. have a vagina. That's a different scenario. A <laughs> legal <laughs> vagina. Different yeah. setting. It's, it's not like there's a whole meal and then there's cake at the end. The cake's yeah. the only thing here. The cake's the only food. So. Different snare. Oh. So it's manly to eat it all day, but girly to order it after a meal. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Would you that's go really to a weird. grocery store and buy a cake, or is that too girly? I never yeah. have in my life. Ever. I've never bought. I, I, you go to my house. There's no gravy. If you were in my yeah. house recently, thanks to my great generosity. I was. I, I know you didn't look in the kitchen or in the fridge, but there's no cakes, no cookies. No, no desserts around. Yeah, because wow. he eats them all here. Yeah, most yeah. people don't have cakes but see, in the fridge. I, but I wouldn't eat them at all if they weren't if they weren't here just presented, you know. Because gay. Regularly. Yeah. You yeah, know, on a kind of gay. It's it's desserts so are gay. for women and children. Yeah. Sorry. Order, that's, a, that's an interesting take. Ordering dessert at a restaurant is gay. <laughs> I've heard a lot. Oh. I've not. I've not heard that I heard argument that. before. I was, I'm not gonna yeah. say gay. I'll just say feminine. How about that? Feminine. Yeah. Feminine. Feminine. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's feminine. <laughs> it's feminine. John feminine. feminine. It's feminine to order a dessert. Yeah. That's uh, Karen funny. sends us an email. Yeah. Karen Bassey. Uh, <laughs> subject: Seabass's party. Oh. Oh, okay. she come? Yeah, yeah. Would you like to come? She can come to the next one. I'm listening nice. to the podcast. How is Seabass so upset that uh, with everyone not going to his party? But he says it shows him who cares and who doesn't. But did he not recently say that if he was no longer working on the show, that he would not keep in touch with anyone because he didn't count anyone in the show as a friend? We've gotten a lot of versions. He's a hypocrite bitch. Ooh, wow. <laughs> a From a Karen Bessie. That's a Best. strong statement. Yeah. I, said, I, I didn't say friends. I said, but I did say I was friendly with everyone mm. here. Yeah. And I went out of my way to do a nice thing for all of us. <laughs> yeah. Which Ravy saw. She was even only there for half of it. She, she said it was I fantastic. It was yeah. fantastic. I yeah. loved it. As the first one was you, that I went to and I told you well, it was lovely. I, again, yeah. I, I, Woody's on the bottom of my ban list. He's still on it, but he's, he's, he's <laughs> a low, low tier. I think it's just a mass it, it that just shows sinks you, me to the bottom. It's just a low effort. Uh. A bunch of hypocrites here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and we now know that dessert is gay. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah. Says yeah. He, t- he walked that back. He said fem... Feminine. 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 He said Feminine. it was Feminine. Yeah. Feminine. Yeah. Feminine. Feminine. Somebody on the text had a really good idea. We really need, you know, like uh, Ravy's questions for the fellas. Yep. Greg's questions for heteros. Right. Yep. Seabass should really do a whole segment on rules for heteros like you know like what's gay what's yeah. not guidelines right. you might just, be, you know, might be just, just so we know yeah yeah you might be unintentionally unintentionally making a mistake you know Greg <laughs> yeah. like because yeah, Menace and I a nightmare Menace and I we shared that dessert oh. yeah oh, and wow. two guys by themselves yeah and like, not, only shared, not only shared a dessert shared a fondue yeah yeah okay <laughs> chocolate yeah. fondue and oh, in, into which uh, mm-hmm. Seabass then turned around and said that ordering desserts are gay. Yeah. You said he, we were homosexual. Yeah. So, Greg. It was, it was an act befitting, yes. Yeah. yeah but, <laughs> Greg, since you are uh-huh. gay, we figure that you are the. Uh, uh, you got to be, be the, uh, be the, the authority. arbiter. The authority on okay. this. Thank you. And I also made my own list of random stuff yeah. that Ooh. I even think seem, seem kind of gay. Yeah. Yeah. Wonder so, if Seabass would agree. So, Seabass, what do you uh, what do you say? About the dessert, about the you said well, some rules. Okay, well, I rules say, for heteros. Like, at, don't order dessert. Right, don't order dessert as, a, as a man. Uh, if there are options, do not order any kind of white claw. Mm. You know, if you're at a party or whatever, that oh, we got I see all white claws. They're okay. now like behind the bar. They have you know they'll have cans of seltzer. I mean, uh-huh. mixed cocktail, mixed drink, vodka sodas, beer. So no sure. seltzers at all. Like a truly, hey, you, you could have one. Yeah, I, I, but I, I can't order a white claw. I would have to order like a vodka soda, like a cocktail. Right, or if you're out in public, yeah, yeah. you wouldn't. You would, but just not a vodka cocktail, like in a can. Right, no, not got it. Not at all. All right, not I'm all. making notes because wow, you know, Greg. Know. <laughs> yeah, you don't. I, you don't want to do the wrong thing. Yeah. I don't want anybody confused me. If you with, want to be a thousand percent dude. hetero like me, uh, right. this is not right. that there's anything wrong with being right. gay. What else? I'm just saying, right. if you want to be on this side right. of the spectrum, what else? Never, never initiate a hug. Oh wow! Unless it's you know, unless uh, you're at a funeral, basically, okay. <laughs> or it's wow. been longer than let's say two or three years. Oh wow! 
But yeah. yeah, if like I, I know men who are like they didn't see they saw guys three days ago and they're like right. they go in for Never a hug. Initiate yeah. a what hug. is that? <laughs> okay. What are you doing? Okay. All right, can't hug. Oh god, oh, initiate a hug. <laughs> Your wow. chests are all touching. <laughs> got yeah. it. All right, uh, got another one. Uh, that's good for now. Okay. I, for not now. don't drive a Miata. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of car based ones, but I don't really want. I'm not a car person, so I don't yeah. care that right, much. Greg, question: okay. What about using a straw? That's a good like, one. Like so, like would they bring? <laughs> Very good one. Let's say that you like you, you've ordered a, you've ordered a diet a diet coke, yeah. right? And right. the and the waiter oh. waitress says, "Would you like a straw?" And I go, "Sure." Uh -huh. Um. Well, some say even ordering a diet coke. That right. Be yeah, that's oh. true. Well, let's yeah. let's true. stick with the straw question. <laughs> right, right, right. I think. Mm. You know what? I'm I'm ruling. No, that's not gay, but it is uh. childish that you can't drink without ah, a straw. Okay. Right. Well, it's sometimes not gay. the ice just gets in the way, you know. And it, it's not gay, but it's also not a thousand percent hetero. So I would say no straws. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, but I gotta go. With, I gotta go with Greg's opinion on this guy. What about like um, uh, somebody texted over the underwear aisle? Underwear aisle. What about? Oh, it? yeah. Like if you're at the store, the underwear aisle. Yeah. Well, like you're, yeah. You're you're a, you're a straight dude. You're a bro. And you go into the underwear and aisle. You're browsing. Just because yeah. there's pictures of guys in the underwear? I mean, you're yeah. in the men's underwear. You know what the I mean? The underwear yeah. aisle is yeah. definitely a place where if you're, you know, questioning, you're on okay. the fence. Got oh, it. You're, that will turn you gay. Got yeah. it. Oh. Underwear aisle. Uh, another question on the text. <laughs> Sitting next to your friend of the movies with no empty seat between uh -huh. you. Oh, yeah. If there is space, then you should have the buffer seat. Yeah. That's, that's an oldie. That's what you oldie would do? Goodie. I yeah. thought that was only for urinals. No, like if, when you go into the public. Why would you want to intentionally rub shoulders with another guy? Uh, I'm, I'm not really knees, rubbing. I'm not putting. <laughs> here's the thing. I'm not putting the armrest up. Right. You know? right but I'm not right. making it into the, As into a man, the love you seat. Have, you should have manly broad shoulders. Well, the last time I yeah. went to the movies with Woody, there was those huge Recliner reclining seats. seats. Those are so that's cool. different. And we obviously. sat next to each that's other. That's fine because those were yeah. big. We also made out. I was going to say, eventually ended up in the same seat. And then we 69. HJ. Over the pants. Yeah. Right. Right. I have a long list of things that you might think are gay, and right. I think are slightly gay. All right. Okay. Okay. Well, you mentioned weddings to what? us. Cats and weddings. Cats and weddings. Incredibly gay. There's nothing gayer than a cat. Well, <laughs> this sand represents my family, and this sand represents your family. We're going to pour them into the same vase. Right. Like, yeah. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Right. Okay. Is that what you're kind of talking about? Are you, totally. Or are you just talking about like there's it, it so is, much and like flowers yeah. everywhere yeah, right, right, right. and, okay. and right. harps. Harps are gay. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> on my list, I have bookends. Uh, like, <laughs> oh, yes. I, think, I think bookends. Like if you Thousand go out percent. and okay. purposely yeah. buy bookends. something just to hold the book up. Right. Like yeah. you've yeah. got rocks. You've got beer. Right. You've, you've got, got bottles. Empty you've got empty got rocks. Yeah. You, 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 probably, you probably have an extra free weight from your gym. You know? Free weights, <laughs> empty yeah. liquor bottles. Right. Or yeah. you can just take, cans. take the next book and put it on its, on its side. On its side. Yeah. Right. yeah, I would say. Uh, would, go out and buy bookends. So many options. Incredibly gay. Yeah, so many options. I've I've always argued like uh, eating a banana. There's no way to look manly eating a banana. Okay. Yeah. Right? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Like but, yeah, but then you could put a hot dog on that list. Right. Right? Yeah, yeah. Anything, corn or dog. a churro yeah. or anything. I know, yeah. but just the way yeah. you eat a banana, it's straight up and down, and you're like, Ugh. Same with you know? churro. Same well, you with know, You could eat one just don't dog. let anyone see you. And also, yeah. when you're peeling it, it kind of looks like uh, somewhat like when a chick is like, you know, uh, house cleaning your, your unit before she does her thing. Oh, okay. You know, okay. I've heard that. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's a little too obvious, though. Okay. All right. I think Hawaiian shirts are gay. Uh, okay. No, Depends on the situation. Yeah. Are you in Hawaii? No. It also okay. falls into fat party guy mode. You're right. Mm. True. Right. Which is the opposite of gay. Okay. This <laughs> one's way too obvious. Portraits of fruit or still lives. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like a, you have a painting of a bowl of cherries. I would say most art is gay. Oh, oh, oh. most yeah. art in general. <laughs> art in general. Unless it's like in super general. brutal, like that new, uh, that, that, uh, King Charles portrait's yeah. awesome. Yeah, it's, oh, it's yeah. hardcore yeah. badass. That's a little right. more right. manly. Right. Yeah. You know, like the okay. thing that whenever Tony Soprano got the him as a Napoleon sure. with the, the horse, yes. like that's yes. manly. Sure. I'm, with, yeah. I'm with an animal. Okay. Right, yeah. that's hardcore. Yeah. Also on my list, fountains. I think fountains seem gay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like a water feature. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. Like that's interesting. You went to somebody's house and they had a yeah. fountain. Yeah. So on one hand, it's like very Louis the Fourteenth. Yeah. Like, but on the other hand, uh, I would say like a bird bath certainly gay. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> a bazillion percent. Uh, like open this. face sandwiches. Oh, open face sandwiches. It does. It's very. That's very brunch. I would have yeah, never yeah. thought about that. Right. Mm -hmm. but it's like you're talking about like avocado toast. But look, avocado yeah. toast with Greg. salmon on Fichetta. it. I mean, I like them. Greg, this is this is your community. I'm not going to question your decision right. here, but I would make an argument for Ooh. the uh, open face sandwich. Me too. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know. And cookbooks mm. definitely on that list. Right? <laughs> cookbooks. cookbooks. Like you can just wing it or look it up online. Yeah. <laughs> But if you have a book, what about would, that's very and feminine. now I have yeah. like twenty of them. All right, what about Keurigs? And I have a fountain. Keurigs? Yeah. No. Like if you have a Keurig machine? No, I don't. 
I don't think that's gay. No. Like, shouldn't you just have, like, a coffee pot? You right. Know? Yeah. I, I, I'm with Woody on that one. Really? You really? Yeah. I'm just asking. I'm, 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 I'm taking- like, What if you just don't want to- dainty or I'm taking, what? Yeah. I'm taking some off the uh, off the text here. Mm. Okay. We're just trying to learn. This is what we're trying to learn. Here, here's- Okay. Here's well, a- I have a, both. Here's a rebuttal. Yeah. Here's a rebuttal. Getting a straw with a drink is okay because there could be germs on cans or uh, glasses. Uh, caring mm. about germs is gay. Yeah. So, yeah. You're a <laughs> you, yeah, you wipe yeah. it off on your pants. You, yeah. You've refuted your argument. Yeah. Duh. Caring <laughs> about germs. Yeah. 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 Sorry. Says the guy who washes right. his shoes every day. Okay. Well, for uh, going back to footwear is another one on the text. Boots. Boots? What about them? That, oh, like, well, it depends um, on how, if you're wearing them with leather shorts, then that's different. Right. It depends. <laughs> Well, uh-huh. I mean, is it a pride I, situation? Okay, are you a cowboy? If mm, not, right, right. I wouldn't say boots uh, are gay. I would say being excited about boots yeah. is gay. Yes, okay. you know what I mean. Like, oh, yeah. it's fall. Out, I can put on boots. Check out my new boots. <laughs> you know, uh, okay. seven one four says certainly Uggs. Never show your feelings. That's gay. Oh yeah, showing emotion. <laughs> yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, unless someone's dead. I or mean, dying. Back to the funeral. A couple things are acceptable at funerals. Right. Right. Um, uh, Greg, you, well, you know, you I disagree see, with that. But you've never seen your dad cry, right? I don't think so. See, because he's. An, I've never seen you know, my. I never seen my dad cry, no, even at funerals I, yeah. for like his dad. Even as no, he's gotten I, older. Actually, agree. No, because yeah, that's the thing that happens. A lot of men. Yeah, their, guys start crying more when they get older. Estrogen. What he knows. Yeah, my dad didn't even cry at his own mom's funeral. So. Yeah. yeah. No. But the feelings thing, I know that I learned that from Ravy because that's your biggest pet peeve. Men with feelings. <laughs> oh man, oh, oh all yeah, the feelings. Yeah, well, about <sighs> stupid stuff. I'm still I'm still <laughs> laughing about fountains. Fountains. That's so yeah. funny. I do have a fountain too. How about oh. public fountains. Only, yeah. Are they? Here's mm. I, I, I like to see that as um, <laughs> modifying it to bird baths. That's very right bird because baths. like a lot of those fountains are like, like that's a lot of emperors put that up to as a demonstration of how powerful and ri- uh, rich they are. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Check out my fountain, bro. Look yeah. at the Trevi fountain. <laughs> <laughs> the sculptures, yeah, cause they're right. big. Because I'm, like, I'm, yeah, I'm bro. Old stuff. This but, might hit home, but what about bird feeders? <laughs> Um, oh, gay. Yeah, that's well. No, okay. Hold I on. think no, of that as like an old man <laughs> hobby. Yeah, no, hold on. Different. Okay, yeah. yeah. Hummingbird feeders, gay. Wait, like, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Regular yeah. bird feeder, like a house whoa. that you built by yourself. That's yeah. that's manly. All right, cool. And yeah. hummingbird but feeders you have always to have, have the built the bird flower. house, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Or or it has to be like and not my from brother a, loves his hummingbird hey, feeder. Hey, hey, <laughs> and you got to add to that, not from a kit either. Oh yeah, yeah. You're, you're sanding. Yeah, you have to go get the raw materials. You get your own wood. Yeah, you cut that up in your garage. Gingerbread crap. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, what about uh, carrying a water bottle? Oh, Ugh. yo, mega gay. Well, I'm not asking you. I got to go to Greg on this one uh, first. Because that that a uh, woman brought that up a while ago, right? Yeah. She said, "Oh, guys who it's carry inc- around bottles, so dainty. it's incredibly feminine." Yes. I saw one. He had. It, I saw a guy the other day. He had one hooked to his belt. <laughs> like, oh yeah. And again, yeah. forget forget That's gay and not ones. gay as we've talked about. <laughs> impractical. Right. Yeah. It was, it was fifty years ago. Were people dying of thirst? It was no. hooked to his belt with a carabiner. Does that make it? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Ooh, Ooh, that's yeah. Pretty yeah. Carabiner Ooh. makes it. Manly. By the way, somebody also said going on a hike. <laughs> like if you go on another hike with a dude. I say Ugh. yeah. If it's a hike for no yeah. purpose, like hunting, obviously different. Going on a hike. Going on hiking for a purpose to get somewhere you know to do what? something manly, different. I, I, I could be swayed that that seems slightly gay. Mm. All right, another good question on the text. I'm ordering a pair of shorts. What is the minimum inseam I can uh, order? Five, seven, inseam? nine. Oh. Okay, so this oh, is, this we're is interesting. about length. Right. Yeah, so, so the inseam is like five, seven, nine. It's, it depends oh, on where yeah. you're going. Short shorts Typically, yeah. Come oh, back. As like, it goes to your back. knee or... Or beyond? Beyond to be hedro. Well, there's a lot of, like, look at, you know, Magnum P.I., very hedro. hedro. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That was just the style at the time. Right. Yeah. And those shorts were short. Mm-hmm. I mean, right. very. I think they're questioning. I like it. I mean, we could say you know you can make your argument today, but back in this, you know, Bruce Jenner was the was that's the true epitome yeah. of masculinity, and that was yeah. just the style. Short shorts, yeah, real short. What do you think? Uh, um, seven? no, and I'm Seven's also minimum. Mm, five's pretty I'm short. Fi- I mean, five I can't is even hella imagine short. Five are nut huggers. Yeah. The so, question is why. And if you're famous, you can wear anything. Right. The question okay. is why do you need them to be short? Well, because they're short by nature. Why do you, well, why do you need like? Why do you, why do you need, need long shorts? Right, but I, I would agree. But why do you need it that close to your sack? Yeah, uh, I don't know. Maybe like the hug. Maybe you just want the to hug show, of it. You know, off your calves. Yeah, let's go. I, let's I don't know. Weird. Let's go with nine then. Nine. <laughs> right. Sure. These okay, that's the minimum nine. Nine's like the probably the one of the longer the that ones that you need. Oh, it is. That's yeah. probably to the oh. knee almost. Greg, yeah. what about fanny oh, yeah. packs? Hmm. I think any kind of bag though, right? 
Depends yeah, on, but I mean, guys what, who are carrying around a bag. I hate that society doesn't allow it. Well, <laughs> I mean, you, you would. Phone, wallet, keys, yeah, sunglasses, would. and you got to put everything in your pockets, and it ruins your whole silhouette. Yeah, but you got to think about like cool straight guys, Greg. Right? Yeah. Well, for straight put your, guys, put, your, put yourself in the mind of a cool well, straight guy. Well, then I guy. would think fanny packs are gay, or okay. a bag. Well, there's a way to get around that. You just call it tactical and make it like black and rough. Mm. Yeah, well, yeah. Man. Put a bunch of paracord on it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, well, now that we have some uh, rules of the road, so to be. You know what I mean? This is a good jumping oh, off point. Wait, where do you one... draw the line at Starbucks? Uh, Nothing just with in general. Man, you can get a lot of crazy, yeah, you know, a lot of like. With whip and drizzle yeah. and. Like the you know what? Corn. I would. If you're a man and you're ordering a complicated coffee, that's pretty gay. Mm. Like, just mm. order a coffee. Yeah. yeah. Nobody Black. orders nothing, coffee. Nothing with whipped cream on it. No. Mm. Oh, really? No, I'm asking. Is that like, where would you draw uh. the line? See, I am a fan, though. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to stick to it. Anything more than just, yes, I'll have a coffee is gay. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Like if you're doing half this, half that, half calf yeah. with whip. And yeah. it's got to be hot, though, right, too? Like, Yeah, I would think iced so. Iced coffee. A lot of people on the text on that one, too. Iced coffee. I, I, understand, yeah. I understand why, but I'm I'm not on board with that. Right. Well, and look, Woody, on your list is umbrella. I've, I've, by the way, <laughs> yeah. I can't use an umbrella. I've changed on that. Have you? I, yeah, I mean, like, oh, okay. it's got to be, a, it's got to be, yeah, it's got to oh, be a certain, God. it's got to be a certain level of rain. I'm not, I'm not using the umbrella for like a drizzle because to me that's just more inconvenient than anything else. I'm not worried about getting a little, little, little sprinkle. Okay. Right. Mm. If it's pouring, well then, yeah, no problem. As a younger mm. man, would have been caught dead with an umbrella, okay. but I've grown and I do plenty. Of, I share desserts with Menace. I oh, order yeah. desserts. Yeah. So oh, yeah. according to, to wow. Seabass, you yeah. and I should be married. He's on the spectrum. <laughs> yeah. Sure is. Yeah, but for the guys out there who this is really important to, I think this is a very educational, very insightful segment. You might be doing something yeah. you didn't even realize. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, accidentally. Woody show. There's another text. What about escalators, Greg? Escalators? Yeah. Uh, when there's stairs and escalators, and they're right next to each other. Well, you know, it's always been a pet peeve of mine when people stand on escalators. Right. Like, are you that yeah, yeah. lazy? Especially yes. the down escalator. Yes, okay. I am. <laughs> R- ruling on escalators? Yes. Like, no, um, probably not. Not gay. No, no. So. No. Uh, this one says, this segment reminds me of these videos, this Be a Man guy that's on Instagram. Dude, I, I was telling you about this guy a couple yeah, of years ago. Yeah. When I When I found this, I was laughing my ass off. Dude from Massachusetts, it's just Be a Man, at Be a Man, and he had... St- falls right in the line with what we're talking about here. Here we go. Donate your organs when you're alive. Be a man. Yeah, see? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's how you're really a man. You, yeah. you donate your organs when you're still alive. You could be a man. Right. That's manly. Uh, <laughs> right. Um, hmm. How about uh, how about this one? When you come home late after a night of drinking, puke so loud you wake up the whole house. Yeah, be a man. Be a man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see? You or, know, um... Like, <laughs> this dude this guy has made so much money doing this account yeah, he does events so there's a book yeah. wow he's got merch he's got all kinds of stuff yeah when you meet someone shake their hand and try to break it be a man yeah be a man <laughs> yeah. I mean there's a there's a ton of them he's been doing it for years now yeah, uh, so many of, of these things wow I like this one if you tell your kids to clean up their toys and they don't Throw all this shit away. Be a man. Be a man. <laughs> Can it? Yeah, at be a man on Instagram. You could uh, you could check it out there. And if you have any other questions for Greg, please feel free to send it over on the text. It's an ongoing yeah, workshop. So, you know, Greg and Seabass can get together yeah. and really make a decision on it. <laughs> Laminate really looking, that list. We're really looking forward to uh, Seabass's next party. If you know what I'm saying, his big coming out party. Getting. 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 You know. And we'll all go to that one. I promise you, see, yeah, No we'll, dessert, though. Yeah, even Greg will go to that one. Right. Yeah, there'll be no dessert there. No dessert. <laughs> no, nah, because, you know, it's gay. Hold up. More Woody Show. Woody Show.